Hello, good people. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's a lady here, Debra. I'm back again with another good video. So, on today's video, like you've seen in the title, I'm going to deliver unto you that word that God wants you to hear in this season and at this point in time. So, if you're the returning subscriber, welcome back. But if you're new to this place, please go ahead and subscribe help a sister crew here so without wasting any more time let's journey into the word oh yeah <laughs> i got a different look today i've been trying some magnetic eyelashes i'll leave a link to that video down in the description box if you're interested on how i installed this Yes, I did it myself. It was quite a it was quite a hassle, but at the end I managed to come out with this. Bulgy, girly, <laughs> beautiful look. Okay, here's the thing. God is the God who is after His word to fulfill it and to make sure that it always happens so he sent me to you again today with another word he's been speaking he continues speaking excuse me with the background noise the people who are playing inside so he says we should guard his word and see if it comes to pass to judge whether it was our minds or God actually did spoke. So here's the thing. <laughs> if you've been following my videos so closely, the previous one where I was talking about the voice of God, this one up here, God was talking about the new season, new things happening in your life, new doors being opened, and everything that was about to take place at that time. He was more emphasizing on you entering a new era in your life, experiencing things afresh, getting to smell the flowers, enjoying those luxurious things you haven't been enjoying once or back then wow what a word i took it and i ran with it and i'm enjoying the benefits if you haven't seen that video make sure that after watching this one you go check it out because some of the things in there can still benefit you today as you're taking this journey with god so today 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 i have good news for you i have blessings to shower upon your life i hope you're ready you're relaxed and willing to open your heart and let the spirit of god minister to your heart as i'm going to be releasing this word okay <laughs> if you clicked to this video obviously this word is for you so make sure you listen up until the end so that you don't miss it actually i feel like i'm wasting time by trying to but you can tell by the look of my face i'm so much excited i'm over the moon i'm wow this god that we serve is a genuine god he's omnipresent omnipotent he never lies always talks to us because he loves us he doesn't want us to stay in the dark about tomorrow that is why he keeps on communicating to his people so the lord has sent me to you with the word today he wants me to let you know that you are next in line your time has come your moment is here 
and you are done crying. What a word. What a word. I'm going to try to explain to you the vision that I had that compelled me to come and deliver this message unto you. Yes, the Lord has been speaking a lot this month, but I was kind of a little bit selfish, taking everything to myself and letting it benefit my life. But now that I've been gracious enough to come share, sit down. Yes, sit down, relax, and listen. All right. I don't know where exactly to begin. Should I give you a narration of the vision I had or should I just elaborate it to you? <laughs> okay, next time. Next time, next time you will get a chance to tell me what to do because I might go live. But today I'm just going to tell you like details, details, details because this vision was containing quite a number of things in it and all these things are happening in your life and when you get to hear that God was really talking to me just just go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section I, I really want to know who is connected to this who is connected to this okay the thing is God promised you a destiny. God promised you quite a number of things to come to pass in your life. You've been sitting there waiting for them to take place. And at some point in your life, like a few weeks ago, you've been questioning yourself of whether what God promised upon Okay, <clears throat> my battery just died, but I'm back. I would say the Lord is talking to this category of people. People who have been seeing other people get things, being blessed by the Lord. And as for themselves, they haven't been receiving any signals, receiving any confirmation of whether the path they are in is the right path the lord sent me to tell you that yes you chose the right path what you're doing is what you're destined to be doing don't lose heart in it continue doing good continue working on that project that you're working on stay in the line that you're in because you are next in line for a miracle. The way I saw the Lord doing it, it was really, really a miracle because the way you were expecting it to come to you, it didn't come to you the way you expected it. It just happened out of the blue. You just woke up and noticed that things have changed. <laughs> so, I was viewing it in the present and it looked like it happened in the past but it's about to happen that is why the lord allowed me to come let you know that you're next in line for a miracle so this here is the thing that path that you chose to walk by that road that you have taken yes it's going to lead you to your destiny but here's the thing, in the vision that I had, when that path came to the middle, there was something like a crossroad, like there were now two paths. So because you are next in line, 
you're not going to go for this path that was somehow chaotic because the people in that line were fighting they were pushing each other they were fighting to get to the front but the favor of god the grace of god is going to locate you and take you to the right path that you have to follow in this day in this state god wants you to know that he will be the one directing your steps you're no longer going to be walking by your own force but he's going to be the one directing you in which way you have to go so one other thing that i wanted to communicate to you concerning what i just saw is that yes people are going to talk trying to take you out of the way take you out of the line that leads you to your destiny but again there are other people who are going to talk you into the line so that you get to go and receive that which the lord has already prepared for you so these things it's going to happen like immediately like you you can't you you ain't going to be able to trace what exactly have happened but at the end of the day you know that this is the lord's story it's not my story i couldn't have achieved this with my own wisdom with my own strength so while you are next in line and you are getting ready to receive this which the lord is preparing for you you need to praise him you need to worship him let yourself just be in his presence you know forget about all the troubles the struggle the negativity the noise surrounding you and everything just let him lead you by the way take you there where you're supposed to be here's the thing <laughs> when you get there this is what is going to happen my goodness okay there were angels assigned to distribute everything that was there and as they were distributing there's this particular three people that had to stand aside because the package that they were about to receive was way too big it was way too big like big and as they were standing aside and the package was being packaged things were being poured into the containers the what they were doing was just to smile like they wore a smile they were excited and at that point in time they started to realize why they saw it delaying to come to them because now they could see what was being prepared because they were so close to the place whereby the miracle was being prepared hmm and among all these things that were being prepared for them some okay and among all these things that were being prepared for them relationships were part of it like i don't know how to put this but these people who were involved couple who are involved they are a kind of people who who know exactly what they want in a relationship the kind of person they are looking for and they've been rejecting everybody coming along they ended up having a shield upon their hearts because they didn't want to get hurt like being exposed to every relationship that they come across so this one as it came i I got to watch like the future of the relationship that they are going to enter into like <laughs> yeah it was something like you know having like having having something in your mind and you literally get to taste what you always desired let me try to be specific here <laughs> there was this woman there was this woman who 
person who didn't like being approached like you know you see first time encounter and you want to be intimate you didn't get to know each other and stuff like that so i i got to watch how the relationship was going to go and she was so excited because she loved every step of it they just distracted me <laughs> i really don't know where i ended but let me just wrap it up let me just wrap it up for you you know the thing is it's finally happening relationship wise i don't know if this person that is coming it's a colleague or part of the family somehow but when you see him at first you're going to think he's noisy but when you get to know him and let your gut down because you have put those things to protect yourself it's then that you see that wow this is exactly what i've been looking for so in short all these blessings that are awaiting you they are so big there are so many and the angels that are delivering unto you the angels that are delivering them unto you are so excited to deliver them because i saw them doing it with a smile you were smiling they were smiling and at the end you asked them how am i going to carry all these things they're so heavy <laughs> and they said you need not to worry about that somebody will help you carry them home so my advice to you is as you praising god worshiping him doing all that enlarge your territory because whatever is coming it's so big that you can contain it you can contain it one more advice before i close this is that keep on wearing on keep on putting on that positive posture yes don't frown don't be sad don't be mad it's finally here smile <laughs> okay i'm sure you are amazed at the tone of my voice because i can be loud sometimes but today it had to be different if you watched up to this far thank you go ahead and subscribe if you haven't see you in my next videos and Ciao for now.